Sam Smith steps out with his father Frederick for casual stroll in NYC after admitting he's going through some mess amid split from Brandon Flynn. He hit headlines earlier this week after it was reported he split from 13 Reasons Why star actor Brandon Flynn following nine months of dating. And Sam Smith put on a brave face as he enjoyed a low-key stroll with his father Frederick in New York's Soho District on Friday afternoon. The Stay With Me hitmaker, 26, opted for comfort as he was clad in a sport high white tee, teamed with casual navy shorts. Continuing his casual display, the singer wore a pair of box fresh canvas trainers and all black sunglasses as he walked arm in arm with his father around the streets of the Big Apple. Meanwhile, Frederick displayed his youthful-looking appearance in a patterned vest and similar shorts to his son. The Like I Can Belter's outing comes after he confessed he's going through some mess during his performance at Brooklyn's Barclays Center on Wednesday. Candidly addressing the crowd, he said, I know that everyone in this room right now is going through some mess. I know I'm going through some mess. Sam and Brandon are understood to have broke things off last week, with a source telling The Sun, Sam and Brandon had a real whirlwind romance. They really fell for each other. But they are both so busy with their careers and unfortunately things just haven't worked out. The singer, who has deleted a number of snaps of the pair from his social media accounts, is said to be devastated about the split, as 24-year-old Brandon was the most significant romance the Too Good at Goodbyes singer has had. The insider added, Sam is obviously devastated. This is the most significant relationship he has ever had. Thankfully he is on tour across the U.S. at the moment which has been a welcome distraction. The alleged split comes just months after the singer claimed he was excited to finally pen some happy love songs after finding love with the actor. Speaking in January, he said, I'm in a relationship right now and for the first time. I think I deserve to be happy. I'm actually asking myself if I'm going to be writing some happy love songs soon.